The last queens return to oblivion. Sorry to keep you. Effective immediately, you lot have been remanded to my charge. You're safe now. You didn't come all the way to Militess just to confirm our identities and pick us up, did you? Chancellor Kalia is in Militess for negotiations on a long-term truce with the Empire. I am here as his attendant. As I am also your commander, it is my duty to brief you and give you instruction. Commander, permission to speak freely. What is it? The Consortium must have known about our mission. Why would they agree to peace talks? Because the Consortium had no reason to refuse. The Empire offered to make sweeping concessions. But we succeeded in destroying their weapon prototype. They're just trying to stall for time! The Empire made their proposal before you accomplished your mission. We didn't receive word because we were not able to contact you. Does the Consortium honestly believe that the Empire has no ulterior motive? Whatever the other side may have in mind, once the treaty is drawn up and signed, this war will be over. Any further questions? It will be some time before the peace negotiations conclude. I'm sure you're all exhausted from the operation. You may stay the night here and return to Rubrum tomorrow. You are on leave until tomorrow afternoon, with permission to move freely outside the military zone. It's not every day you get to visit the Militesi Imperial Capital. Why not take a look around? Yes, we will. Don't forget, you are cadets. Make good use of your time. That is all. There's no need for formalities here. Be at ease. Yes. Indeed. Uh, you are the queen of... I beg your pardon. I am Andoria Kaya Tronka from Futurio. I have come to Militess on behalf of Concordia, to take part in the negotiations. Wow! Not so loud! Queen of Concordia? Oh, you serious, yo? I didn't think she ever left her castle, hey? I bet only a handful of people outside the kingdom have ever seen her. Your Majesty. What brings you to see us? Yes, I know. Hmm? You oppose the ceasefire. No, I... I... <laughs> yes. I don't think it's right. The Empire invaded Rubrum and defiled our crystal. How can we possibly ally with them now? Your thoughts are at odds with the will of the crystals. <laughs> We've sworn fealty to the crystal, and we have never betrayed that oath. How can you say that we're at odds with the crystal? There are friends of mine who inform me of what the crystals are thinking. <sighs> I was chosen by the dragons, and so my heart is united with theirs. The dragons are manifestations of the crystals. Ergo, our hearts are united with the crystals. 
Are you saying that the crystals want this truce? Look at the full picture. What the crystals wish for is balance among them. A world as it should be. In equilibrium. Certain fates cannot be achieved through bloodshed. If you fail to understand that, then you will bear the burden of Phoenix. And why are you telling us all of this? That is because you, as I have seen it, are the final cogs. Oh. May the path you follow be bright and... <laughs> so, why did she come here again? Machina, at the very end, what did the Queen say to you? Well, I'm not really sure. Something about a choice. It didn't make any sense. But what does she mean by balance? Are we supposed to just sit back and do nothing? How are we just supposed to accept that what she says is in fact the will of the crystals? You know, I can't talk to dragons. But if the crystals don't want a war, then what exactly is it that we're fighting for? Oh, good question, Ram. Work so hard, tear up my room. Only 12 hours for next next mission. Uh -huh. Damn it! Where where the save point at? Damn it! Uh, okay, let's mm, let's first talk to let's talk to them first. Hmm. What's wrong? You're all pensive. I was just wondering, why did they want to give us this room? Hmm? Observe our surroundings, Sink. The barred windows, the guarded exit. Hmm. Hmm. Maybe it's a guest room. There's running water in here. It's nice. <laughs> Perhaps. Wow, you're stupid. She is stupid. No, something's up. Something's really up. You got a point there. Why are the guarded rooms and the freaking barred up windows? I, I got, he got a point. What's really gonna happen? I'm kind of scared. Okay, let's go talk to, talk to them now. I'm a little tired. You don't look so good. You should get some rest. I'll stay here with you. That's okay. You wanted to see what's out there, didn't you? But, thanks. You're still the kind Machina I always knew. Not really. It's just that looking around Militess won't fix anything. That's all. Uh-oh. Are you blushing? <laughs> if you're healthy enough to tease me, then you're fine. <laughs> I'll just take a little break here. Yeah, I'll rest for a bit too. Smooth, Machina, smooth. All right, last one. We gotta talk to Scythe. I don't like it one bit. We were just in the thick of it, and now suddenly, here we are, on standby, stuck in the middle of enemy territory. This has got to be the stupidest order ever! Yeah, I, I agree with you there. That is a stupid, stupid order. So, it wants to talk to you? No? Okay, let's leave. Can I leave? Report me before you leave the hotel. I'm not going to maybe on sea fire, but it doesn't mean you're free to do whatever you like. Machina, do you have a sec? The commander wants to speak with you. The commander? What can you want with me? You guess the good mind. Well, you want me to find out then? Oh boy. 
I like this. I understand you wanted to talk to me? Well, I thought long and hard about whether I should inform you of this or not. Mm -hmm. And perhaps I may regret doing so, considering the current circumstances. Sir, what is this about? It's about your brother. Uh -huh. I understand that you're not satisfied with the information you've received about his death. I've been informed that you've recently made inquiries pertaining to your brother's death. I can't find any records about the mission my brother was on that day. As I'm sure you've guessed by now, he was killed in the line of duty while completing a top secret mission. My brother on a top secret mission? Class Zero's involvement in the Capital Liberation Campaign was highly classified. Even I didn't know until the last minute. Therefore, it suddenly became necessary to dispatch a liaison between Class Zero and Operation HQ. The liaison that was chosen turned out to be your brother. That's why he was so far out on the front lines? Yes. Your brother died because of Dr. Aratia and Class Zero. You could even go so far as to say they were the ones who killed him. He was originally assigned to a different mission. But Class Zero took him for their own use and sent him to his death. It was unnecessary. Your brother didn't have to die. They killed my brother? Class Zero and the Doctor's objectives remain a mystery to us. That is why we assigned you there, to monitor their actions. But to think there was such a connection between you and Class Zero. If it is too hard on you to be with them and fulfill your mission, I'll pull some strings to get you assigned to a different class. Of course, then it will fall to Rem Tokimi alone to monitor them. No! Please wait! I can't leave Rem alone with them. I mean, for one thing, I don't think Rem could spy on her own classmates. She's too... kind-hearted for that. I'll remain on my assignment in Class Zero. Oh, ho Such courage! Just what I'd expect from Kunagiri's brother. If you see anything suspicious, report it right away. Right. Brother, I swear to you, they took you away from me, but I will become stronger than any of them. I lost you, and my memories of you, but I will never lose Rem. I will protect her, no matter what. Whoa! Holy crap! So that's why his brother died. So Makna's getting all badass now, like, don't worry, Rem. Opera, wait, what? What's happening? Oh, hey, Moogle! Hello, Koopo. Hey, Moogle! Mog and Orderly Arya are still on duty. So we're here to back you up, Koopo. Oh, well, thanks! Talk to Mog if you would like to use Academia facilities, Koopo. Uh, sure, right, um, but now I'm just gonna save, but, uh, thanks, Moogle. So, when we come back, we're gonna find out what's the deal with this whole ceasefire thing. So, thank you all for watching, don't forget to like, favorite, and subscribe, and stay awesome!